Once upon a time, in a quaint village nestled between rolling hills, there lived a young traveler named Koji. He was adventurous and curious, always seeking new experiences and eager to explore the world beyond his village. One day, Koji decided it was time to embark on a grand journey. He dreamt of visiting distant lands, meeting different people, and discovering the hidden wonders of the world. Before setting off, an old Zen master named Akira approached him and said, Young traveler, take this map. It will guide you on your journey and lead you to places you've never imagined. Grateful for the precious gift, Koji set out on his adventure with the map carefully tucked in his bag. As he traveled through lush forests, vast deserts, and serene valleys, the map indeed proved to be an invaluable companion. It directed him through challenging terrains, helped him find food and shelter, and led him to breathtaking sights that filled his heart with wonder. Yet after many months of travel, Koji encountered a fierce storm that raged for days. The unforgiving winds and torrential rain washed away his belongings, and in the chaos, the map slipped from his grasp and disappeared into the muddy waters. Devastated and feeling lost, Koji sought the guidance of the wise Zen master, Akira, whom he had met before his journey began. With a heavy heart, he explained what had happened and how he felt aimless without the map. Akira smiled warmly and said, My dear Koji, losing the map may be a blessing in disguise. The true journey lies within yourself. Embrace this moment of uncertainty, for it is an opportunity to discover your inner compass. Perplexed, Koji listened attentively as Akira continued. In the absence of the map, you must learn to trust your instincts and intuition. Let go of the need to follow a predetermined path. Be present in each step you take, and you will find that the world will reveal itself to you in unexpected ways. With newfound determination, Koji embraced the Zen master's words. He continued his journey without the map, but with a heart filled with gratitude for the experiences he had gained thus far. Each day, he observed the world around him more keenly, learning from nature's wisdom and finding joy in the simple wonders of life. As seasons changed and landscapes transformed, Koji's spirit blossomed like a lotus in a vast pond. He met kind-hearted souls who shared their stories and wisdom, and he found himself connecting with others on a deeper level, unburdened by the confines of the map. Years passed, and Koji returned to his village, a transformed man. The villagers were eager to hear tales of his adventures, expecting grand stories of exotic lands and legendary places. Instead, Koji spoke of the profound lessons he learned within himself and the beauty of living in the present moment. The villagers listened in awe as he recounted how the loss of the map had led to the discovery of his inner strength and wisdom. From that day on, Koji became known as the wisest traveler in the land, and people sought his guidance not in maps, but in the art of finding one's true path. And so, the story of the lost map lived on, a timeless reminder that our greatest journeys are not always in the external world, but in the boundless depths of our hearts and souls.